Good morning, my ordinary president. Mm. Good morning, madam. Good morning, sir. Uh, yesterday, I talked to me when I go first bank. Yes, sir. Uh, now, you be the woman where they carry your 68 million naira. Yes, sir. Out of your account. Yes, sir. This is the money where you gather for how many years? For 18 years, sir. 18 years where you did for abroad. Yes, sir. All the money, all the uh, overtime work where you did do, where all the suffer where you suffer, all the deny where you deny yourself momentous luxury with the hope, say, if you hustle this thing, by the time you come back, life go good for you in your old age. Have you not be so? Yes, sir. Yes, All sir. of a sudden, they can't tip your 68 million naira in your bank account. Yes, where sir. Where belong to uh, First Bank. Yes, where sir. Where they for Bini Ring Road. Ring Road branch. So yes, sir. after we do this matter, where we engage the bank, engage, make we uh, appreciate the bank for the response. <laughs> now, after we engage the bank, Instead, where they go return your 68 million naira, they can return how much? 51, 51 million, 900. Now, your money remains 17 million. My money remains at 17 million, 17 million plus. I don't really know the... You go do the calculation, make we know the exact amount. You know the exact amount? Yes, sir. 17 million, 17 million sir. So, exactly 17 million? Yes, sir. Exactly 17 million? Yes, sir. How 16... Uh, uh, 68 million naira they go come give you 51 million 900 and the money go remain 17 million within the, the worry the, the total money sir is was uh, 68.9 so they paid they paid oh, 51.9 million yes, uh -huh. so they paid 51.9 yes. so remain 17 million now okay you see percy percy anyway make we leave and make i know branch too much now we can't, yesterday, I can't advise the woman, go, withdraw this money, this money where they, where they return to. When, when I can't go, uh, Barista Pamela. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. What will happen when, when I go? Good morning, my ordinary president. Mm. Good morning, Brexton. So when we got to the bank, we met the, another person, and they told us that the branch manager, that she's on leave, so we met someone that was sitting in for her, and we explained um, everything to the woman, and she asked her of her account number, which she checked, and that was when we realized that the, bank, the account has been frozen without her consent. So I her account, we, we, they recover the money back now. Yes, sir. They don't freeze them. Yes, sir. And by right, a customer should know when you are doing anything to his or her account. Yes, but she, she wasn't in the know. No, sir. She was not informed. No, sir. They go freeze her account. Yes, sir. Okay, if it be say now security measure. So now where she don't go now, unfreeze the account. Make I take my money if not be punishment. Say because she come break at a family. Many people don't lose their money. You get one man where they come here where Zenith Bank chopping money. That man's money is running into millions of dollars. We're not going to hear that one, but make we finish this first bank on. So, uh, Barista Pamela. I asked her, can we have um, access to the phone? She said no, that she can't have access to it, that she has to update the accounts, that she has to fill about three different forms. That was what she filled. It's just like opening a new account again. And they asked her to bring utility bill. So what delayed that yesterday was that the utility bill they sent to her from Bini does not have um, an address. So she now asked them if she can use her address in Italy. They said yes. But coming this morning again, she told me that they called her late last night and told her that they won't accept that um, utility bill from Italy, that she should bring the one with Nigerian address. That was that's after then. That's when they will now allow her to have access to her money. I now asked them, what about the balance? What's going to happen? She said we have to write, that they have to write again to the bank to say, this is my exact money. And this is the balance. So I'm not paid my complete money. But another thing, again, she said was that the bank is now claiming that some people were using her account to deposit money. But after going through her statement of account, we realized that in 2020, when she stopped depositing money into the account, it was about $5 million that was deposited without her consent. And she didn't know who deposited that. So we are now asked her, okay, let's assume $5 million was deposited. What about the remaining balance of her money that is yet to be paid by the bank? 
Then she said we should write it and I make an application. Uh, Barrister Pamela. Yes, sir. When I they hear where people they shout, once they see money, where they know no, they go call me ordinary president. Yeah, they pay twenty million naira into my account. Yes, uh, I don't know where uh, another person. This, you see, we no longer have a lot of career bankers. We have um, contract staff as bankers. These people have got no reputation to protect. They have no career to protect. Now, these people, now them, they connive with scammers. Now then they give your information to the scammers. Yahoo people fool everywhere now, including children where they own a house. Your son, if they use your in phone, now Yahoo if they do. Your daughter, if they use her phone, now Yahoo she they do. May God protect us. Amen. Now, this money, they go pay them into your account. The manager or the account officer, Sabi why? Now you go mm -hmm. open the account. Mm -hmm. The money go enter. Mm -hmm. If you are lucky, you see a lot. The following morning, they don't remove the money without your consent. So money enter, money come out. What did they do? Now diversion. Then divert the attention of uh, investigators. When they begin investigate this money, we then take from somebody or oh, now um, ransom money. You don't now your account they go Congo. You no even know say money enter your account come on. So they go block your like one bank where the owner he get bank he get telecommunication company. What we hear say then they do say the telecommunication partner there who they do the uh, uh, um, fraud with them. They go block your line. When I remember one, one Baba we retire from uh, Julius Beggar. One Baba where they take and do yeah yeah where you go police station police collect money for him in breakfast. Police enter moto uh, take egg roll and uh, mina allow Papa to trek. Una and remember the Papa. They go collecting sim. You go the in the blocking line. You go to complain. They collect the sim. They seize the sim. They begin beat them. For the same bank, uh, cellular communication company where the owner get bank. So now, what will they talk here? They say, maybe put it very careful. Your account officer can block your alert. Your officer can do a lot of things. He has access to a lot of things. Nobody here we do. Account officer for is do signature of in client. Divert money into in private account. The man come here. The forensic department of Central Bank of Nigeria could not do anything. He had to engage external forensic auditors. They were the ones that discovered how the monies were stolen. And Central Bank could not do anything. Instead of, when I feel remember the exact amount uh, with and thief out of the man or, uh, account, they can't give a part of the money. And according to the uh, the bank, they say, na Central Bank of Nigeria say na the amount where they go pay be that. In other countries, Central Bank, they protect the interest of people will be clients to banks. Here, the Central Bank of Nigeria, they give authorization to identify your money. If not, how can Central Bank have a policy that authorizes you to have a wallet account? This wallet account does not carry your BVN. This wallet account did not carry your NIN. This wallet account has no no and single single means of identification you need the microphone uh, borrow us that microphone no kyc this ogranya thank you very much ordinary president you see what i see in this thing central bank has a lot of questions to answer particularly for the confidence of their customers 
uh, if you look at this very well, what they have just done is to create difficulties around her access to that money. So because they know that already she has lost confidence in the bank. And as soon as that money is returned, the first thing she will do is to move the money to be sure that money is safe. So the banks naturally do I that. I even talked about on uh -huh. air yesterday. So, they, so which one? They create those difficulties so that she cannot move the money until they begin to look for how to appease her and make some offers to her. Uh, but again, uh, all of these questions about go and bring a, um, a utility bill or proof of address, they know even from the matter that she doesn't live here. So which utility bill is she going to bring? Are they expecting her to forge it? By the time she forge it, as they expected, they will, they, go now. They will now use that. Uh, so everything central um, uh, first bank need to do to restore public confidence on first bank they must do it and the first is to return her money allow her unfettered access to her money you see now this one how people they talk tabarmo kwenya and they tell the hawka that is um um eh eh now in a one do direct translation uh, they say nagragra. They they take um, they they take a uh, commod for where shame day. Mm. Like say me and you they gossip a larger now. Mm. Me at the back mm. this side. Mm. You the back this side. A larger can't come from back. Mm. Only for us to turn. Mm. She say a larger don't tell for that place. Mm. You can't be like say cut. You be like say she here. What I talk? Mm. They go come turn, look at say, Elijah, yes, mm. that is what I talk. I talk him. What do you? Now him be this thing. Now him be not the tabarman kwenya da hauka. But if they get sense ordinary president, because this one why I talk. You know, say even yesterday, the group account where you asked me make we open, mm. uh, somebody been there suggests uh, banks as quickly as he mentioned. As I say, wait. Mention first bank. I say, make it, make them solve this problem first mm. before we go go enter. Our own go gone become Only the same God story. Can be how many people mm. first bank don't check And them. if they no solve them quick, or you know go be bad thing to advise our followers to say, I beg, open your eye for where you they put your money in case your money don't day inside already. Make you shift first until first bank arrange their house. Mm. Because this one they show say their house need to be arranged. And uh, me self, the little money where I get there, I they think now. Whether stop thinking, Ogaranya, go and clear your money. No, I've been one way small. Whether they go solve this go one, go and clear I it. I go first. use them as an example. Go and clear it first, pending when they will settle this matter. Thank okay, you. Okay, ordinary much. president. Because if you bring complaint, come here. I no go attend to your I complaint. Beg, make I go now. No, no, no. After the program, you won't run. <laughs> How can you tell the, a woman that has lived abroad for 18 years to go and bring? A Nigeria address. They sent her the address, the, the utility bill. How many bills they carry house address? How many houses get address for Nigeria? They say me she go bring utility bill. Okay, first of all, she can ask, can I use my Italy address? Yes. Only for them to call her at night. No, you must bring Bini on. Ah, uh -uh. and we have Central Bank of Nigeria. Director, uh, uh, what uh, uh, corporate communications cannot say no, 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 no. This is unacceptable. Ordinary president, we have, uh, we we are going to harvest this case from you, and we are going to tell the bank for you to know how on how untrustworthy. Uh, the this, central bank is this one where you just mentioned central bank director com, uh, communications are you ordinary president I never even mentioned to you one woman i think that baris tuche direct and come here he retired from first bank or the sacam in a very unjust way later on the little money where they're supposed to pay them they no pay them we don't do everything even i sent text message whatsapp to the communication team of central bank they said they go call back to you now oh, the right. day where that matter come on air now now them go face complaints say Oh, now they run them down. A former staff mm. of Central Bank of Nigeria, mm. the thief money of, uh, for Adana, Anambra, Abina, which state? The one where CCTV. Yes, where the money. thief money, they come begin, they accuse everybody. Him, you quickly, as an ICT person, 
you go to the CCTV camera uh, storage, he extract footages will show who and who thief the money. When I go express it, they go honor this member. Yes, sir. They sack him. The ones where he capture where they thief money for Central Bank of Nigeria, they promote them. Not be only Central, not so Nigeria be. Not be thieves, they occupy leadership position for this country. Yes, sir. Not be thieves. Yes, sir. By law, you have to prove. But by African culture and tradition, before the law, Uyibo law come, we get our own culture and tradition. If you carry what you know belong to you, you are an automatic thief. If you carry anything we know belong to you without the authorization of the owner, in Africa, you are a what? A thief. Simple. They are thieves. But I, Indioshi, and Wole, and Woji, Igbechi, Ombai. How are they call thief for your language? Only. Oh, eh? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, make the, that woman talk alone. We, eh? Which language be that? It don't matter, eh? It don't matter, eh? Oh, oh. Give them. Yeah. Oh, goja language. Oh, goja language. Oh, whoop. Oh, whoop. Oh, ye. Uh, give uh, oh, no, she. Uh, hey, nah, you be that. Uh, bo, bo, uh, bo. Give uh, tailored by Basile. Oi. Uh -huh. Now, nah, which language? Ibia. Uh -huh. They are owned. Igala own and Ibia own. They always resemble. Hey, wa, hey, wa, Baba de here. Guido. Gu which language? Fulani. Uh, Fulani. Hey. Guido. Guido. Aha. <laughs> Now, waiting some of them be where they occupy leadership position, some of them are thieves. They know they are thieves, but it is the law that is protecting them. That is the reason why a governor will finish eight years and be struggling to become a senator. It is because he wants to hide under the umbrella of the law. Are we together? Yes, if not, as a governor for eight years, what are you doing with senatorial position? Ah, uh ah, -uh. and you are collecting pension as a as as a former governor. If na civil servant collect two pension, problem go day. But public servant is receiving pension as a governor. Some states, after two years, they buy you cars, they buy you this, they do they, they build another house for you till you die, and then you go come be senator again. And when you no day for senator again. You go to collect another pension as a senator. Se pension as a governor. Pension as a senator. May they arrest them. Natives them be. Collect the money they have collected as senators. Uh, as uh, pension. As uh, 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 for senate. Or oh, pension go for governor. Make them choose one. May they recover the remaining ones. Nigeria. We must get it right this time around by the grace of God. Amen. <laughs> My ordinary president, at the point of opening account in a bank, they say, know your customer, KY. Why? Why are, if they have taken her address before or a utility <gasps> bill, why are they asking for it at the point of withdrawing? Because already you know she has been transacting on this. If you give una all this information una for open the account, no, now when we thief her money, she don't catch you now. When I go de, tell her, say, Missy, what of the documents where she give on her where where warrant may make on open the account for her where she be they pay money where accumulate to 68 million naira. give us a uh, first bank uh, uh ordinary president the way where this thing they go i beg just give me a few minutes make i go call my no, account officer give i fit before program finish they go talk say make i go bring my late papa or mama grandmama <laughs> A birth certificate. I beg. Make Congo. I just go a few minutes. Congleton, I. Yes, sir. Call me the public relations officer of First Bank now. May them pay this money. We must get it right this time around by the grace of God. If you not get them, Google them. Anybody will get contact with the spokesperson of the First Bank. Director of corporate communications or anything where they call them. 
the person will get the authorization to speak on behalf of First Bank of Nigeria, whether a PLC has been a limited. Yesterday, the woman they talk say they tell her say me she go meet First Bank, she go enter bush go for that elephant where the legs short short. Elephant no way where no few go move go anywhere. Blue elephant, we know they exist. Madam. Yes, sir. So now what thing they subject you now they torture where then they torture you be this. Yes, sir. Before they even give me the last time where I go collect the statement of uh, account, it even take them hours, it take them days before they feel release them for me. There be no one give me before. Wait, Faisal Umar said this first bank opened an account for someone with my phone number. Mm -hmm. And I went there and complained. They say it was rectified. But up till now. I still receive a lot of another person's account. Just first, I'll just make a make a screenshot this thing because after the live uh, uh, broadcast, the all these comments they disappear. In fact, I will set up one TV now where we will set up camera in front of the TV as we the stream. They go they capture all the uh, comments. Faisal Umfuna check and Faisal Umar, he say. This first bank opened an account for someone with my phone number. And I went there and complained. They said it was rectified. But up till now, I still receive a lot of another person's account. The same first bank. May they re try to rectify this thing on time before the Anyash go open well, well. Oh, but then you see them maybe. Okay. <laughs> Ask me with the meaning of that thing where I talk. Yeah? Please, what will be the meaning? What will be the meaning? Yes, sir. Oh, God, I translate. <laughs> oh, no, president. I did look for the director of oh. communication. <laughs> oh, God, why did they laugh? You know they hear Igbo. <laughs> Bashir Hussein Ahmed, he said, ordinary, I was a banker before. <laughs> now, so them they do. Uh, uh, ordinary president. Oberon Sine may be OK. Alvin the, Vitalis, he said, mine is two different accounts. I don't understand. Please, Vitalis, uh, Alvin, uh, try explain. Two different accounts mean, uh, uh, mean waiting. Bashir Hussein Ahmed, he said, too much corruption in the banking sector. One executive, tell me, say, anytime where they want to give people money, they, any of their orgas need money, they go, so, uh, um, the ED not say they need a social amount. They don't go anywhere. They will just enter people's account. We draw five five naira times maybe three. That's all. I'm telling you, oh, 100, 100 naira times no. Even if they send a lot, you see 100 naira. You will not go understand what it. A former ED of a bank, now he tell me this thing. He listen to this program. He did Kaduna now. Me and I meet for train with the discuss. He's the ordinary president. If I tell you the Nyama Nyama within the bank, you go go withdraw your money. He said some withdrawal. You you can never explain. Okay, no be here with you. immediately. The former central bank governor. He changed most of his government account. Ogada, oh, what did they call the thing? Stamp duty. Stamp duty. Tax. For every transaction where you do, they will withdraw that money and it is supposed to go to the government. No, no individual is entitled to the right a tax except government. After Bugudaji has already exposed how the, the thief uh, uh, stamp duty money, the, that same week as we they do the program, they changed stamp duty to Ele electronic, electronic money transfer fee. Which means this every money bank is, begins the message and the email to customers say so uh, we, there is no more stamp duty. So this money is electronic are going money to the individuals, individual banks now. 
instead of going to the government uh, account. And when I saw that ordinary president, and I, I trillions of naira have been done accumulate for ground. Mm. Where could I call expose here? Because the man know they hear English well, well. When I take them, they do yeah, yeah. Somebody has, in fact, document within my hand now. Waiting, could I just expose? Where would they talk? Say the man, they be like, uh, say you know, sabi money where well, where. Well. How can Nigeria have? those trillions of naira out of 100 percent of that money where good agi kaza where where then thief where thing good agi kaza will get access to information now about 30 percent good agi kaza will never sabi the amount of money where then thief for this country i make i tell you now mfla is not a fool you and get uh, diary we carry the names of the people we follow Follow and thief money for this country. And the ordinary president, when that thing happened. And if Unane had the names of the people, we follow and thief money for this country. In fact, he was a helpless man. Now, instruction then they give him. He foolishly followed their instructions. People from Villa, people close to the president, people, people that are movers and shakers of this country, were the ones stealing money, our money. But I, yes. And when that thing happened, ordinary president, one of the Brekete family senior advocates tell me when I reach him, say, see how they take change tax, where the government money into now corporate personal money uh, from uh, stamp duty to electronic money transfer uh, fees. So he said to me, make I know even bother about that and that that thing is a perfect fraud. Oh, that they pro there was a law that they passed that now permitted that change. That he didn't do that. He did that through the National Assembly. That it wasn't that he woke up one day and did that. That they went to National Assembly, passed a law, a bill, that permitted them to do that. The senior advocate said to me that there's nothing you can do about this. Except Nigerians wake up and begin to say, what happened to that tax? What qualifies the government or lawmakers to change what was government tax would, to become personal would, would remember money? Remember, one honorable come here. He said now overnight they assemble a few uh, members, mm. National Assembly members. Say mm. the the ones who no go or, uh, oppose the thing. Mm. They allow the ones who go fit challenge the thing, made mm. them go. Like say nothing mm. go happen. Mm. Everybody. Some senators even way approve this thing. They drive alongside the mm. good senators. Mm. Ah, good night, good night, honorable, mm. good night. After they reach uh, federal secretariat, they, they make you turn. Come, come back. Come do sitting. Come pass this law. It was the same sitting that they made law that now made him the chairman of the how central can you, bank board. How can you He's be the, the central bank governor and you are the board chairman of the board? That was that, the gov that governs Central Bank of Nigeria. That was why when the Sorry, Minister for I? Finance was complaining that they didn't tell her about the currency change. And I spoke to one of their corporate communication person. He started laughing. I said, make you go rest. Say that in a day for constitution, a day law. Say they no supposed tell them. Say they not them get authority to do. The minister no no say they don't go change the law. So they are, now, they are now like an independent, they are not working under the, uh, the uh, Ministry of Finance. Now, I have uh, Barrister Hindu, good morning. Good morning, my honorary president. Good mm. morning, everybody in the family. Mm. Uh, my bank, there was a time they deducted uh, 53 naira 75 kobo for maintenance fee, card mm. maintenance fee. Mm -hmm. The next day, they deducted another 53 naira 75. Uh, mm. 75 kobo. I noticed that. I went through and I saw that my ba my balance had changed on each deduction. So it wasn't like they sent one message at the same time. I now sent them an email. I said, I need an explanation. They now said, it's, I have two cards. I said, as far as I'm concerned, I have one card. And I never authorized another card. They said, I have another account. I said, show me now or we'll meet in court. Because I know I only authorized one card. It's only one card I know. Mm -hmm. I have never authorized. So if you're doing, if I have another card, then that means you people are using it for fraud. Mm -hmm. The next day, as I did, I just heard a let. My 53 naira 75 couple. They don't return now. Let's appreciate yeah. Barista Hindu. So many people over here. 
but just give small, small deductions. Those are the deductions they use to cheat people. I said, now, for my ED of a bank, Nain exposed this thing to me. And presently now, you get documents where you then give me about Central Bank of Nigeria. If I open these documents here, Nigerians, and I go soon open them by the grace of God. The it's next better. the next move we then go do now to close down the radio station. I go tell you now where we go they meet. It no go be radio at all and we can communicate freely. There's a saying in how the ordinary president. Yes. <laughs> Lies only flower. And mm. flowers die. They mm. wither. Mm. After a few days. But the truth bears fruit. Mm. And that truth lasts for long. Mm. So that's basically it. We, as long as we continue sweeping things under the carpet, we are not going to We get will out of expose. This we will expose. Thank and you very much, Barista. Mm. Please can I use this opportunity to enlighten people? Mm -hmm. My friend was um unfortunate to have been caught by these one chance people some weeks ago. There are plenty for Abuja now. Mm. Yes. So what happened was she stopped the taxi, she wanted to take a drop. So the man said, oh, I have two people. Let me just uh, drop him there. Uh, so she now magnanimously agreed. They took her at 6.30 in the evening at Area 1. They went around with her. They ensured that they beat her up, carried everything, ensured that they drained all the money from her account. Then 10 o'clock, they went and dropped her, pushed her out of the car at Lakeview uh, side. Uh, that could be side. That yes, now there be the um, dumping ground. They nearly oh, killed. You, you remember yeah. the Uber lady? Now there they go dump her. Strip her naked. Uh, so that's their hostel. Um, so but, anybody that wants to leave to a drop, if there's no, if, there, if there's if there's anybody in the car, forget it. Barista Rebuke Hindu. That car. Barista yes, Hindu. Yes. Even Uber now, then they use them to kidnap it. Huh. Do you know, say, one chance people, they carry POS now. Arm robbers, they carry what? POS now. Yes. So this Those bank... They carry four POS. This one, they carry four POS. Was, four POS was what they used. And they cannot trace them. <laughs> why? Yes. When I know why, do you know why? This why? useless central bank's policy that says you can open a wallet account without you identifying yourself. No NIN number, no BVN. You can just open the account... When you are done duping people, you close the account. Nobody can trace you. Well, that's recorded Yahoo. And it has been, it's now a policy since the bank has enforced it. It's recorded Yahoo. Thank you very much, Barista Hindu. Thank you. Make Thank we you appreciate her. Much. Imagine say she not be a lawyer. She look for recover her 53 Naira. They do and once. They can't do and the second time. Now, how many of you now? And that to 10 million persons. Yes. Or 20 million people. Mm. Calculator. Is it for me? They, they say the video for... Now, viewers' discretion is not only advised, but highly recommended. Excuse me. Hi, let me... Good let me t Hello, morning. good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I know they hear you well. Okay. No. Lembe, lembe. Oh, lo, lo, lo. My ordinary, I'm still surprised, honestly, people are banking with First Bank. Fa. First Bank debited me 465,000 naira. That they, it was for a transaction. My account became minus 150,000 naira. Mm -mm. On a Sunday, my ordinary, not Monday, not Tuesday. On a Sunday, upon going to the bank on Monday, they said, eh, I did a heavy transaction. I don't even know what heavy transaction means. During COVID, who was even transacting? Mm. 2020, April 2020 was the last time I used my first bank account. After I walked into that bank, I knew, in fact, when they said I was owing them 150000 I said, okay, that one, hold it. I've even dashed you people the minus. My dollar account, my pound account, I, I deactivated everything. There and then. Okay, wait, wait in your name. Too much. Sorry, my ordinary. My name is Fadila. Fadila, Fadila who? Fadila Ismail, my ordinary. Okay, Fadila Ismail. Yes, sir. You don't be ever borrow money from First Bank before that never. time? Never. I have never borrowed a dime from okay. any bank. How can 
it happen that uh, well, that you over withdrew from your account to the no, extent that you are owing 150,000 minus know, they said it was charges i am owing them charges hmm. 465,000 naira my ordinary hmm. during that covid i said if i had used this money to buy cake and pet for my mother you know how much you be getting every month have they given you back your money Wallahi, they never gave me, and I said they should go with God. Uh, no, no, no. Fadila! 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 How many Ordinary. times I call you? You called me three times. During your break hour, go to Maitama High Court, depose to an affidavit, write a letter of complaint, bring it. I will recover your money for you by the grace of Thank God. Thank you very much, my and on not only First Bank, any other bank will tiff your money for Nigeria if you have evidence. Just do your affidavit. We will end their career of nonsense in this country. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, my dear. Sorry, sorry. Uh -uh. So now, now people do fit uh, 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 come out. Uh, freedom on Uchuku. He said, good morning, my ordinary president. I've also received a lot from an account number close to my own account number in First Bank. That was how I stopped banking with First Bank. Mm. So as you receive uh, Pride another Jadon. personal account. <clears throat> Sorry, Pride mm. Jadon. He said, please tell them to, uh, to add volume. We are struggling to hear you. So, please. That is at the social media. Maybe they should add it over there. The social media people, they are struggling to hear. Maybe someone should uh, be watching and listening to the social media to hear what the sound quality is. We are not going to quarrel this morning. The devil is a liar. Because after Iblis, I will be him in a shaitan regime. I will be him in a shaitan regime. Because after Iblis. Because after Iblis. Holy Ghost! Fire. Now somebody make observation. No be vexed when I go vexed now. Eh? I could have no verse with me. Sorry. Uh, okay, now the phone call. Nine day low. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, we're going to use this uh, better phone. And you, as I do on phone, you are, are you not supposed were you not supposed to raise the volume? It was clean on radio. What about social media? So, please. Hmm? Thank you. Um Get me the uh, the spokesperson of the uh, First Bank's number. Kilanko Adiola is my ordinary president. Do you know that if you do bank mobile transfer and the transfer is not successful, in many cases, the stamp duty or uh, whatsoever they give it, change charges, the charges will not be refunded. Yes, yes, even me, I fall victim. But I know, observe now. Now, when I call my account officer, I say, No, they go, they go, they go refund them. I go call them. If they never refund them, they must give me my money. Now, anybody where they hear my voice now, or where they watch this program, and any bank thief your money, let me know that that money no go. We will recover every single penny. We know how some of these big men, thief Nigerian money, take by private banks. We know the banks. We know where they go on. So we will expose them one by one until we recover every single penny that belongs to hard-working, honest, patriotic Nigerians. In fact, even if you be foreigner and you're there for Nigeria, any Nigerian bank thief your money, let me know. We will recover your money for you by the grace of God.